And I think that one of the things that we miss a lot with thinking about, this is probably why I put off talking about lead magnets, is that we tend to think of them as a straight line. And this is a conversation, I do a lot of strategy sessions with people who are, um, they feel like their marketing isn't working. And um, that is often because we tend to expect there to be a straight line between action and result. And yes, that is true in physics, but it is not true in marketing. In marketing, we often have action and like lots of little touch points and the result may be way far away. And so that's why it's important to realize that we're not just trying to go lead magnet sale. I will say even for, I know there's some course creators um, who are online right now, even for you folks, there is some trust building that has to happen. And I'm sure like Kirsten, who is an, has an amazing course-based business, can attest to this because I know how many repeat buyers she has. There's trust building that happens. So it's all about creating connection. So folks can become customers, supporters, fans, whatever your end goal is. So we wanna think about it as part of your overall thought leadership, part of your overall marketing strategy. So it's not just get someone on my list, make a sale. I would love for it to be that easy, but unless you're selling t-shirts, it's probably going to be pretty hard. 